Yes. I've gone for subtlety, I think, Mike, today. Well, it's yeah. still, still glamorous, it still looks fantastic. <laughs> yeah, well, actually, it's going to be a bit of a blustery day out here at Aintree, but should be largely dry. It's been a fine start to the day. And like yesterday, we've got some very mild air with us at the moment. So really, across the UK today, we're in for another warm day for the time of year. And yes, it's going to be breezy. There'll be a few showers around because we've got a waving weather front that's just going to sit across some northern parts of the UK, bringing a bit more cloud. But towards the south, it's it is going to be high pressure that dominates. So a bit more sunshine, especially in the south, compared to yesterday. Now, the area is likely to see a few spots of rain are across parts of Northern Ireland, Western Scotland, perhaps into the likes of Cumbria too. Northeast of Scotland should be, and further south across England and Wales, long spells of blue sky and sunshine around. And that'll lift temperatures to 20, possibly 21 degrees in the south and the east. But typically, we're all in the mid to high teens. Now, through this evening and tonight, then, we've got a bit of rain to come in across the northwest. That's going to be pushing its way gradually further south, fizzling out as it does so. And it's going to be another mild night. So temperatures between around about 7 to 10 degrees as we start the weekend. Now Saturday then starts off dry for most of us. There will be some more persistent rain pushing into the far northwest of the UK and as that heads its way south it'll become more showery so we're looking at blustery winds tomorrow and some scattered showers towards uh, the, the north and the west of the UK whereas further south and east it'll probably be staying dry with some sunshine. So as we head through the day then that chance perhaps we could catch a passing shower here at Aintree on Saturday afternoon for the Grand National but those showers are going to be really hit and miss. Towards the south and the east, you should avoid them, and it'll still be another warm day with temperatures up to 20 degrees or so, whereas towards the north and the west, we're looking at those temperatures pegged back at around about 13 or 14. So things are turning cooler and more blustery from the northwest, and that continues into Sunday as well. We've got that westerly wind bringing showers to parts of Scotland, Northern Ireland as well. I think much of England and Wales once again seeing a dry day on Sunday with some sunshine, but it'll feel noticeably cooler after a few mild days. Temperatures on Sunday for most of us around about 9 to 14 degrees or so. So that's how it's looking over the next few days then. Certainly mild out there today. Should be dry here for Ladies' Day as well but then things turn a little cooler as we head through the course of the weekend and into next week as well. So, yes, we've had a lot of rain recently. We've been talking about all that wet weather that we've seen recently. The ground out here certainly is fairly soft to heavy. Is it going to be a day for your stilettos? Well, I think they've also been selling flip-flops here as well with that soft ground as well. But, but certainly for Ladies' Day, I think it's going to be stilettos, beautiful dresses and incredible hats out here as well. Charlie and Naga, back to you and one hat this morning is there going to be a selection <laughs> oh i don't know i've gone for subtlety with my hat haven't i but i think um perhaps i'll perhaps i'll be able to to wrangle some different hats through the morning for you all right mike bushell hat consultant